Hey guys, Max Selfie Queen here, and welcome back to another War Games event. One that basically came out of nowhere. Um, I was literally like right in the middle of doing the last event, the uh, the second chance one, when I got finished with my match and I came into another one and noticed that things were different and that whenever I went down and died, I didn't spawn right back into the game, mostly because. The event changed like literally that split second and went to the shield regeneration, uh, the armor regen, whatever you want to call it. Basically it is the uh, shields are regenerated after not taking damage for a short period of time, which is one of them that I had said that I thought that they were taking out of the uh, event, but luckily for me they didn't actually take it out of the event. I was so happy that they decided not to do this, um, but they decided to actually keep it in, but it just came out of nowhere because if you guys were aware, some of you might have experienced this, some of you might not have, I don't know. There was a huge glitch with the um, second chance event. Apparently, what had happened with that event was that whenever you would die and you would go back to the lobby, it would literally be kind of like it never happened. Um, also, we're gonna go ahead and skip through a bit of the a bit of the footage here that's you know not really anything interesting or going on because a lot of these matches were just me and my team looting <laughs> but that's usually the way it goes in these games right you gotta have that one point where you're um you're looting at all, uh, the whole entire game, you gotta loot, and then like the last five minutes, all the action happens, of course. As you can see, Loba Bracelet, failing me once again, please fix the Loba Bracelet, please! <laughs> I can't use the Loba Bracelet, Ugh, it drives me insane. Uh, but anyway, <clears throat> yeah, if you guys noticed that apparently the shield, the, uh, the shield regen came in quickly to cover up the other one, because it was so bad. It, it wouldn't register anything, like it wouldn't register you had a match, any damage you did, any kills you did. Basically nothing happened. You'd go back to the lobby and it's like you just re just started the game from the very, very beginning. Nothing actually happened at all. And I was so confused and it was so annoying because the only way that you could actually complete the, um, the, oh, I forgot what it was called, but the, the little, the tracker, the, the, thing that is what this whole event is about to get all your prizes and stuff for completing it well the only way to complete the tracker was to actually leave the game like physically leave the game when you got to the top 10 leave your team which was the worst thing to do and nobody wants to do that unless you're like i don't know a mean person but it just would leave the game and uh and that's that would count as your your damage would count your kills would count and everything would finally start counting but it was just so annoying. So I'm glad that they took the opportunity to take it out. Hopefully they'll fix it. I don't know if it will be returning or not. I had the footage and I had the video, so I thought I would go ahead and post it anyway. Um, <clears throat> but let's just say if it does come back, I don't think I want to be playing during that event. <laughs> this one here though, was actually really cool. I really enjoyed this one. Um, I think it was very interesting. It was very interesting because you have to kind of be strategic, you know? You have to think, okay, so I took a bit of damage. Um, I can kind of go around a corner, let it heal me, and while it's healing me, I can go in the fight again. Or, you know, if you're cracked, and then you, you get cracked, it'll actually say on the screen, cracked, and you'll have to wait a little bit longer period of time before your shields regenerate. So I thought that was pretty cool. Um, it, overall, I just, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed this, I enjoyed this event a lot. So I'm really glad that they did this one. I'm so looking forward to the, um, I think the second chances, or not second chance, um, I forgot what it was called, but I'm, I am looking forward to another event. So far I've only done this one and the other one, so I'm really looking forward to another one. <clears throat> it, it, it's really cool. The, the whole event as a, as a whole is, is fun because it doesn't feel boring um, because you know when you have a, a limited time mode and it lasts for like two weeks it can kind of get annoying hence the uh, the ring flare event um, but yeah it can kind of get annoying after a while so I'm very glad that these are kind of switching around after a couple of days or a day or however long it is 
they have a timer that goes off and after the timer goes off you switch to another event and this will be going on for the next i think two weeks so this is this is going to be cool we're going to have plenty of videos to last us for that pretty much that whole entire time so that's going to be that's going to be very fun very interesting to see um <clears throat> also i think i think right now as i'm filming this one there is another uh event that is coming up as well the next one has actually happened the shield regen went away and the new one has started so i'm going to be getting some footage from that one and then we'll have that one go up as well i don't know how i'm doing all this stuff i haven't really decided yet how i'm going to be doing it all <clears throat> but my initial goal was to release them on the days that the events were active so the second chance one i released the very first day and then once this shield regeneration one popped up, I would release that one. Um, and then once the next one popped up, I would release that one. But then I realized it would be like too many videos to post at one time. Um, so I just decided to just do one at a time. I will wait. I'll we'll probably wait like maybe a couple days or so. I don't know. We'll, we'll wait a little bit of time before we actually um, end, up <clears throat> end up actually putting them all out there. So you'll probably have a, a couple of matches, or at least one I know of, from uh, each event. If I'm able to do it. Uh, unfortunately, I'm having, I don't know, I don't know if it's like me, or if it's the season 8 droll. I don't know what it is exactly. Like, you know how you get towards the end of a season where you're kind of like, I'm done with the season, you know? I don't really want to do it anymore. I'm just so bored with it. Uh, can we get to the next season already? <laughs> And that's kind of the lull that I'm in right now, where I'm kind of like, yeah, there's an event going on. And yes, I will do things for the event. I will complete the tracker, you know, get my rewards, whatever. But I'm kind of ready to start Season 9 because I'm interested to know everything about it, see what's going on story-wise. That's another thing I need to mention as well. I am going to be posting the comic book pages again for Season 8. Once the last page comes out, I will be posting that too. Unfortunately, Season 8's comic has been super boring though. I mean, in my opinion. It's, the, the whole waiting, when the first two, I think, dropped, and then waiting until March the 30th for the next three or four pages, was kind of kind of weird. I didn't like how they stretched it out like that. Um, I guess they were trying to get through like the whole entire season with a comic book page. Um, but I don't know. I didn't, I didn't exactly like it that way. Uh, but I found the story to be quite boring. Only thing that the story was about this season was Fuse and Maggie, which, if you follow the lore of the ent whole entire game anyway, you know the history, okay? You know Fuse and Maggie know each other. Fuse got told he was supposed to be coming to the games, and Maggie was mad about that because she wanted to go, I guess, or something. And then they ended up getting into a fight about it. I don't know. There's a whole bunch of different things that we already knew anyway, but then they're just reiterating it in the comics, which when the comics last stopped, the last thing that we talked about was Octane and his father, I think, was the one that told him that they were going to bomb the, the, the place where they were at, and he didn't believe it, so he actually knew that they were going that was going to happen and they were going to attack, but he didn't say nothing because he thought it was like a trick. And he ended up telling the doc drone who was recorded his whole conversation. Um, <clears throat> but I think I think that's pretty much about it. Uh, the end of the match here, I believe, is going to be happening in about thirty seconds or so. Unfortunately, we didn't get through the uh, we didn't get through the match unscathed, and uh, we didn't manage to win that one. But you know what? It's fine. We just dust ourselves off and we come back again with another match, you know? That's just what we do. <laughs> so I had a couple here that I wanted to show you guys because um, the shield regeneration thing was very interesting. I know some of the events, it's kind of hard to tell what really is happening in the events because there's so such a little detail. like. The, um, the one that's going on today, I believe, while I'm filming this one, there is another event going on. I think it's the Hot Zones, and that one is kind of interesting, mostly because there isn't really anything going on. 
just like there isn't really anything going on in this video either. I think we'll go ahead and skip all the looting again because yes, once again, half the games are spent looting and the other half are spent actually fighting and actually doing something. Um, but yeah, that's that's pretty much the way things have been going so far in my matches. We spend like the whole half of the game looting and not and not doing anything. And then we spend the other half of the game actually fighting and actually doing something. So, I don't know. It's a bit confusing, if you ask me. It's a bit confusing. Because you look up and next thing you know, there's like seven squads left and you've spent the whole entire match uh, looting. So yeah, that, that's, a big, that's a big problem, I will say. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to go ahead and get out of here so you guys can watch the rest of the games. Uh, I think, I believe there is going to be, actually, I don't know if there will be, yeah, there will be one more after this one because we did actually get a win um, on the last game that I did. I'm, I'm actually surprised though because it was another one of those matches where we looted half the game and then we just took the rest of the game to pick up the third parties and get the win, so that was literally, that was literally it. I was just... Uh, I'm just astonished sometimes at the way that the games go. Uh, but yeah, hope everybody's enjoying the event so far. Field regeneration, second chance got cut short. Maybe we'll get to experience uh, that again here shortly. But maybe it'll be um, maybe it'll be a little bit better, and they'll fix all the glitches that have happened with it the first time it was coming around. Um, Shield Regen is here for this video, and then next video will be the Hot Zones, and then we will continue on from there. So, hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video, and I will see you in the next one. Replicator incoming. Let's make ourselves something nice. Eyes on the prize. I'm watching that spot. Someone's been there. I doubt there's anything good left. Let's see what we have over here. Reloading. That was the end of that squad. Nice work. Watching here. Opening shop. Come see the merchandise. Pro Prowler SMG here. Evo shield here. Level three. Don't mind if I close. Let's see ring. some movement. One last thing to worry about. Hair package being delivered. Should I send borrows and nappies next? Looks like a care package is coming in. Big dames in that. Contact my side. Shoot him. Reloading. Reloading. I spy an enemy. Listen up, I'm getting shot at. Reloading. Took care of that one. Good job. Drive set. Check the sectors. Another squad is incoming. Spotted. Double time in it. Off in the chimney. Bad. There's another squad on us. Reloading. Cover me, I'm using a Phoenix kit. Enemy spotted. Target there. I'm spotted. Taking fire. Firing.
One minute. Rings nearby. Let's go. Ring aim far, half of one. Reloaded. I spy an enemy. Ten seconds until the ring closes. Enough, I'm getting shot at. Reloaded. Health drone if you need it. Recharging my shields. Ring's moving. Better run for it. Time's up, and we're not in the ring. Move now. I have eyes on the enemy. There's an enemy near me. Reloading. Grenade out. Fire! Reloading. They're 
Not getting back up from that. Enemy ready. Reloading. Marking our surroundings. Activating jump drive. Delivering replicator. Recharging the shield. Feel good about this care package, shall we? Peacekeeper here. Open supply bin over there. I bet we'll find something good here. Next, gotta hop up here. Anvil receiver. It's go time. Peacekeeper here. Round four. Ring countdown starts now. Scanning the area. Buenos dias. We need to get inside the ring. Pronto. Anyone up for some shopping? Prowler SMG here. Faster, faster, faster! There's someone over there. Healing! Taking a moment to recharge my shield. 
my mom's got a brand new bag. We have the benefits. We are inside the ring. Let's do some shopping. Yes. 